Good morning, MMTs. 5.41 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. Today's date, 5-4-2011. What do we have? MOBI, heavily shorted stock. Not only that, the bears that got articles out on it were looking for the short squeeze. When I say it's there, bam! Already gapping up. Look at that penny gap up. So take that closing price to the last print of 1409 and that's your ratio gap price over here on LVS well there are orders out we've talked about it before getting live here so that you can remember this morning and you can remember how LVS will work MMTs it's very important and the price action remember the news earnings came out and they missed okay here are the big blocks of shares that we monitor that people are selling into right here okay so as they walk the bid higher there are people exiting there'll be another round of buyers and there are a little bit higher price levels and I've already given those out to you MMTs does anyone have any questions uh, as Green Mountain Coffee outperformed its peers and delivered very good numbers for this environment so the way that we look at this stock here today is once it makes its peak and its price action high and it does come down the thing about it is when it pulls back MMTs it will be diminished meaning it will contract the pullback so you might pull back two teenies only and then BAM break out six teenies in the price action model Green Mountain Coffee will stay elevated all day if it's a short off of the high it will pull back because the price action will have price action volatility in there so you're going to have to look at what you know a quarter delta is and whatnot so that you can get a good range as to where the bid and the ask is going to be what the market maker on the floor and where is the SMF market maker going to be right there at that price action with that limit order to buy or sell stop market orders so these are three good possibilities on the day SMF welcomes uh, everyone to learn how to make a market with the public there are thinking patterns the public has all kinds of wacky thinking patterns just like people do about the markets they have their own beliefs don't know anything about it but they all got the answers on this Moby trade, let's see if we can pull back and watch the 1365 area and higher on this one. So if we do pull back to that price, we don't break below it. Well, we know we got to be making that entry. Okay. So I will tell you during the live trading day by looking at the SMF Market Maker platform exactly what it will do. So we're ready for that one long, uh, long on a short squeeze. This one here, the upper prices that I've given out, take a look between here and 4397 and then 4424 and higher to the 50 handle, 49 pennies. Uh, so that'd be 44.49 pennies to the upside. Those are just, you know, some of the price action enjoy the trading day today it's 5 46 a.m. Pacific Standard Time we also need to include one other addition the first solar trade this trade here last night in after hours was just a wonderful trade you can take a look at the closing price then the deltas, this one here will provide an entry as well. However, 
they could try to shoot that price action up to the short side entry and you can ride that but you better know how to get that transaction very quickly because if you don't you're going to be giving up your penny action spreads which are your MMT profits and first solar that's the list that I have so just to clarify it you have in total how many do you have on the trade management uh, review nine I believe two four six eight eight total Oh, eight total. Well, that's nice. Uh, what I would say is then out of the eight possibilities that we have, which are all news related, right? Because Mo uh, Moby, that one is new to me, and I'm the first one to admit when something is new. However, I'm going to monitor this price action and that short squeeze on that Moby there, Mr. Uh, and the, oh, Mr. Mantock. Yes. Really watch that Las Vegas Sands I hit that early this morning already oh you were listening to some training that was really going on in pre-market huh yes I was it was a nice move okay so nice that's, and quick was that's exactly right mr. Mantock in that price action it went right on up there now one thing about this one it's gonna be it's a manipulative it's a manipulative earnings play from after hours so last night and now they're developing shorts they missed the quarter right Mr. Mantock can we talk about that yes correct okay so that's the way that this trades so there's a ratio between its current bid and ask and its closing price of 45.87 pennies there is a yield spread Mr. Mayo is Mr. Mayo here? No? Okay. Well, you, must, you must have went for coffee. Well, it is coffee time right now because it is pre-market right now at 5.51 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. So we have a list, everyone. We have eight possibilities. And these are the four that we're going to be watching. 